There's another important line that we need to be familiar with in the capital asset pricing model, and that's the security market line. So we had a look at the capital market line, and the security market line we see here is fairly similar. You can see it starts off at this intercept that's at the risk-free rate, and then it just extends out. But there's some important distinctions to be made. For one thing, the capital market line deals with portfolios, and it shows what possible portfolios there are, what possible efficient portfolios you can obtain. The security market line deals with individual securities, and it also doesn't have variance or standard deviation, I should say, on the horizontal axis. It has this beta, which is something we're going to introduce today. So this is our security market line, and it's represented by the following equation. The expected return on a security equals the risk-free rate plus the beta value multiplied by the expected return on the market portfolio minus the risk-free rate. So what is this beta? This is what you could consider the level of exposure to the market portfolio or how much the security moves with the market portfolio. So if you've got a high beta, then that